Hello and welcome back. This is Frank. Uh, I did not upload three videos this week, but you do get one video. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, this is a news article about the US Open, which is a big tennis match or tennis competition, really. So the article is from CNN.com. It is Emma Raducanu and Leila Fernandez to meet in first all teen US Open final since 1999. All right, we'll talk about the summary first, then some vocabulary, and then you can read the article. All right. The two competitors, the two players in this match were Emma Raducanu and Leila Fernandez. Uh, Emma Raducanu is from England and Leila Fernandez is from Canada. Both, as you'll read in the article, both of them uh, are from immigrant families. And if you don't know, an immigrant is someone who moves from one country to another country to start a new life. So their families are immigrants. And if you're not a, f a tennis fan, uh, then the U.S. Open is one of the biggest tennis tournaments in the world. All right, now my summary of the article. For the first time in 22 years, the U.S. Open will have two teenage tennis players. Both players have surprisingly made it to the top. They are both from immigrant families. Raducanu is British with a Romanian father and a Chinese mother. And Fernandez is Canadian with a Filipino-Canadian mother and an Ecuadorian father. Their success has inspired people from their countries, and they are both grateful to their families for their success and their supporters around the world. Okay. Now, some vocabulary in this article. Oh, I've made a mistake here. Please ignore that. To have no words. <laughs> okay. Our first one is to advance. That's to move forward or to move to the next level. For example, in a competition or a tournament, if you move to the next match, then you can say you advance to the next match. To defeat means to win against someone, to beat them. Okay, so you have a higher score, you defeat your uh, opponent. Major is an adjective that means important. Stunning means shocking. To qualify is to be allowed to compete because of previous results. So again, if you defeat your opponent, then you can qualify to the next part of the tournament or the next match. To have yet to do something, this is a good structure if you need another way of saying to not have done something yet, you can say to have yet to do something. Okay, these mean the same. Unbelievable, incredible, it's used for something so amazing that you can't believe it. Okay, blistering, in this case, in the article, they say a blistering performance. That would be impressive or surprising. Okay, blistering, you might know from heat, like blistering heat means uh, extreme, extreme heat, very hot. But here, it means impressive. To have no words, ah, to be speechless. <laughs> okay, I have no words, I am speechless. And that means you're amazed, you're surprised, like this boy, if he's seeing something beautiful, oh my god, I have no words. Okay, excitement is brewing. Brewing means that something is building up or increasing. So excitement in the article, excitement is brewing. Then excitement is building up. People are getting very, very excited. And to instill is to make something very important because of experience, especially values that parents teach their children. And you'll see in the article that uh, one of the two players um, says the that what her parents instilled in her is um, something very important to her. Okay. All right. You can go ahead and read the article. The article should be... I will link it in the description. Um, but it looks like this. Okay. 
You have a video if you'd like to watch the video as well about it. And it's not a super long article to read. All right, and when you finish that, <laughs> when you finish reading, if you'd like to leave a little comment in the video uh, and answer this question, should teenagers be encouraged to pursue their dreams of playing professional sports or is it mostly a waste of effort? What do you think? Okay, and why? Alrighty. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching the video. I will see you next week and I will try to upload a bit more. All right. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye.